All right, hello everybody. We are Augean Robotics. My name is Charlie Anderson. Thank you so much for having us out here today. It's really a pleasure to be here. So today, farmers are running out of people. Over the past decade, we've lost nearly 20% of farm laborers in the US. And as a result, if you go out and talk with nearly any farmer today, they'll tell you that they cannot find people to work in their fields. Our mission is to solve this problem by making Wally a reality on farms. But to do this, we're starting first with a simple solution to a big problem. When you get out there in places like warehouses, oftentimes they'll actually will have robots that rove out to shelves, pick the shelves up, and then bring them to people working. So people aren't wasting time and energy running stuff back and forth. But when you get onto farms where there are not enough people and no robots, people waste a lot of their time and a lot of energy running stuff back and forth. And just to give you a flavor for what this actually looks like, here you see a hand harvesting operation. Today in the US, about half of US fruit acreage is actually picked by hand. And in a lot of these settings, people spend upwards of 20 to 30% of their day walking what they've picked up and down the rows. And as you get outside of harvest, there are a lot of other applications where people are repetitively moving material around by hand. And while they might have machinery to do it, if they do, they have to have somebody sitting on that machine driving it rather than doing high value, high dexterity work. So to solve this problem of wasted time and wasted energy running stuff around, we have developed something that we call Burrow. And Burrow is a robotic cart that follows you like a dog without any sort of remote or beacon. Um, and as it follows you, it's also able to record the path you've traveled, which it can then retrace. So it can function as a virtual conveyor belt from where you might be picking or where a whole crew of people might be picking to where material is being collected. So today, if you are a table grade picker, you have to run a marathon for every acre you pick. Tomorrow with the burrow, you won't, which yields an immediate 20% labor savings. And as we look at this product, we're aiming to sell it for around a $9,000 MSRP. A leasing model is possible. We'd aim for about $500 a month. And over time, we also plan to offer a lot of expansion software modules and kits so that over time, people can expand the capabilities of our platform and do more with it. And of course, uh, the, the uh, farm robotic space on farms today is almost non-existent, except in the dairy industry. But it's supposed to grow immensely over the next decade. And small scale robots in particular are supposed to grow to nearly a billion dollar opportunity. So uh, for us to contribute to that, we plan to start in the hand-picked berry segments where uh, paybacks are under two years. Then over time, we will scale it up. And of course, in the face of this opportunity, we do have competition. Most of our competitors are actually based in Europe, or they are not really specifically focused on farms. So we think there's a unique opportunity today for us to move faster and beat them on, into the market. And on that note, over the past 12 months, we've gone from an idea to a prototype that's nearly field test ready. Along the way, we filed two provisional patents and found eight large growers, including one who has interest in 1,100 units, who want to run field tests with us this season. So today, we are fundraising, and we are also expanding our team. We'll use that capital to fund 18 months of work from field test to early sales. And lastly, but most importantly, our team. We've assembled a team of rock star roboticists and people with a background in selling and marketing farm machinery. And with that, we are a GN Robotics. John Deere started with a labor-saving plow. We are starting with a labor-saving robotic cart and a mission to make Wally a reality on farms. Thank you very much.